Chlorophylls can be extracted from the protein into organic solvents. In this way, the concentration of chlorophyll within a leaf can be estimated. Methods also exist to separate chlorophyll A and chlorophyll B. In diethyl ether, chlorophyll A has approximate absorbance maxima of 430 nanometers and 662 nanometers, while chlorophyll B has approximate maxima of 453 nanometers and 642 nanometers. The absorption peaks of chlorophyll A are at 465 nanometers and 665 nanometers. Chlorophyll fluoresces at 673 nanometers and 726 nanometers. The peak molar absorption coefficient of chlorophyll exceeds 105 m-1 cm-1, which is among the highest for small molecule organic compounds. In 90% acetone water, the peak absorption wavelengths of chlorophyll A are 430 nanometers and 664 nanometers. Peaks for chlorophyll B are 460 nanometers and 647 nanometers. Peaks for chlorophyll C1 are 442 nanometers and 630 nanometers. Peaks for chlorophyll C2 are 444 nanometers and 630 nanometers. Peaks for chlorophyll D are 401 nanometers, 455 nanometers and 696 nanometers. Ratio fluorescence emission can be used to measure chlorophyll content. By exciting chlorophyll fluorescence at a lower wavelength, the ratio of chlorophyll fluorescence emission at 705 plus or minus 10 nm and 735 plus or minus 10 nm can provide a linear relationship of chlorophyll content when compared with chemical testing. The ratio F735 slash F700 provided a correlation value of R20.96 compared with chemical testing in the range from 41 mg M-2 up to 675 mg M-2. Gietelson also developed the formula for direct readout of chlorophyll content in MGM-2. The formula provided a reliable method of measuring chlorophyll content from 41 mg M-2 up to 675 mg M-2 with a correlation R2 value of 0.95.